causes of too high testosterone in women and the best natural remedies to fix it. If you are struggling from symptoms like weight gain, hair loss, oily face, oily skin, but also cystic acne, and also mood swings like feeling depressed, sad, and this changes during the month, this can be the symptoms of too high testosterone. Of course, the best way of checking this is with a blood test. But if you suspect it, or maybe if you already know your free uh, testosterone levels, this is a video for you. In today's video, I would like to at first discuss the main causes. The main causes are too much insulin, too much leptin, so-called insulin and leptin resistance. Of course, unhealthy gut and inflammation, poor diet and you know unhealthy lifestyle, nutritional deficiencies and adrenal issues or too much stress, but also hormonal imbalances like too much estrogen and too little progesterone so i would like to give you a couple tips and tricks on how you can fix all of them and improve your testosterone levels in even one two months so the first one is intermittent fasting intermittent fasting is great because intermittent fasting will help you to regulate this leptin and insulin levels that are linked with you know high testosterone the way you do it is you want to skip breakfast and you also want to use this himalayan salts with water okay i use them every day i drink my water with himalayan salts this is good for two reasons the first reason is this prevents your fatigue and tiredness during intermittent fasting because this is full in electrolytes but also if you're struggling from some kind of you know adrenal problem this also helps if you want to take it to the next level this is our supplement electrolyte boost pro this has more electrolytes inside and works usually better than himalayan salts this is amazing guys again for intermittent fasting just try it out for two weeks and you will see that your insulin sensitivity will improve another lifestyle change that you want to apply is eating less frequently every time you eat you spike these insulin levels you want to prevent it and you want to stop it so please stick to two free meals you know specifically what i'm doing is lunch and dinner and that's it and this should also improve this insulin sensitivity and in turn can balance your testosterone levels okay another tip is of course to improve your inflammation in your body so make sure to get some ginger turmeric use you know chamomile lavender teas to decrease this you know stress inside your body and calm down your inflammation but again if you're searching for a good supplement that has everything in one I recommend our MSM ginger turmeric anti-inflammatory formula on h-boss.com. This should really help with your gut problem and also to calm down this inflammation, okay? Another thing that can cause this high testosterone is of course too much estrogen. Estrogen not only affects your liver, so messes up with, you know, liver metabolism, but also can cause this higher testosterone levels. So the way you want to get rid of, you know, excess estrogen, you want to apply two supplements. The first one is DIM. DIM is usually found in cruciferous vegetables. So you can either eat more broccoli, cauliflower, or you can just get it as a supplement. It's called DIM, okay? I'm going to write it down below this video later for you. And the second one is maca root. Maca root is also amazing if you're eating this daily, if you're supplementing with maca root, this should help you to balance your estrogen levels. In addition to that, you can be also using flaxseed. Make sure to rotate flaxseed so you don't use them you know, all the time. Use for two weeks and then stop for two weeks. This should also help you to balance this testosterone and estrogen levels, okay? Another cause of too high testosterone is of course adrenal issue and too much stress. So there is a couple tips for that. First tip is avoid blue light before going to bed. This should improve your sleep quality. And in this way, you are balancing your stress levels, you are calming down, you're relaxing, you are decreasing your testosterone. Another tip is implement some yoga, you know, deep breathing during your, you know, during your day. This should also help you to calm you down and decrease these testosterone levels. If you are searching for a good supplement, you can take our calm and sleep formula from h-boss.com. That's because it has a lot of adaptogens and adaptogens are herbs that help you to balance this cortisol and stress levels, like for example, ashwagandha, okay? All of these herbs are great for balancing your cortisol levels. 
And another tip is get some vitamin D. So spend some time under the sun. You know, during the intermittent fasting, what I sometimes do with my wife, we go out, we have some walk uh, under the sun. We are, you know, sunbathing in this way. And higher vitamin D levels have been also shown to decrease inflammation in your body, which in turn can help you to decrease these testosterone levels. And last, last remedy, as I was saying at the beginning, a gut problem can also mess up with your testosterone. So make sure to have some bone broth. In the previous video, I was mentioning that, uh, you know, we cook our own bone broth. And this is very important. Do not get bone broth from shop, from supermarket, because they are low quality. Cook your own on our website, thyroidboss.com. You can find our recipe that we are using for bone broth. You can store it in the fridge for even a week and nothing happens. This is super, super simple. And make sure to have at least one, two cups every day. This should also help you to decrease this estrogen, optimize your progesterone, and this way you are balancing your testosterone levels, okay? So those are all the basic tips for testosterone. Uh, you can find more tips on thyroidboss.com. Let me know in the questions below if you have some you know, questions and I will be more than happy to answer them. Thanks guys for watching and see you in the next video.